The original harbor was small, with a quaint little fishing wharf. It was quite nice, but it was obvious that the harbor was landlocked and the boats could not go in or out. I decided to put a window in the pond to give the impression of an inlet entering the harbor and to allow fish to greet the visitors. The rubber pond liner was removed and a window opening was cut into the retaining wall. A layer of old newspaper was placed over the dirt and fiberglass angles were installed to frame out the window opening. Fiberglass mat was laid up wet with polyester resin. It covered the pond bottom and ran up and over the sides of the block wall. At the window opening, fiberglass cloth was laid up wet, overlapping the mat liner and the fiberglass angles around the window opening. After the resin cured, spacers held the window between a quarter and a half inch from the liner and silicone sealant was injected into the gap. Rock veneer panels were bonded to the side of the pond with stone adhesive above the waterline and silicone sealant below. The thick layer of sealant allows relative motion between the cement and the plastic window, which is caused by thermal expansion. To complete the illusion of an inlet, the track surrounding the harbor needed to be interrupted by a drawbridge. I chose a Schweitzer rolling lift bridge, which rolls on the curved ends of the bridge girders, causing the span to roll away from the channel as it lifts. Plans for a suitable bridge were found in Model Railroad Handbook No. 33, Bridges and Trestles by Kalmbach Books. Larger flat plate panels, like girders and connecting structure, were cut from 1 8 inch clear polycarbonate sheet. Structural shapes like angles and channels are gray ABS plastic from Plastrut or white styrene from Evergreen. G-scale track with formed sheet brass rail was used to minimize the weight of the span. Lead was added to balance the bridge at a point near the center of rotation, allowing the bridge to lift and lower easily and to be stable in the open or closed positions. The fish love their new window, and the inlet is a welcome addition to the harbor. Thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, share it with a friend, or check out some of my other Garden Railroad DIY projects on this channel. Polyester resin and glass fiber present a health hazard and should be handled with proper protective gear. Proper surface prep is necessary to ensure adequate adhesion between parts, whether being bonded with sealant or adhesive. In regions where temperature extremes are great, simply bonding the window to the liner with sealant may not be adequate to maintain a seal.